Hello everyone, my name is Idiotic Synergy and today we are talking about the Space Marine range update. There'll be a meme video later on, so don't worry about that. And what is this range update? They're getting rid of a lot of models because Space Marine has because the Space Marines have been bloated and they're getting rid of a lot of old units. Yeah. I, I hope you didn't buy any of these, because if you did, you've got egg on your face. This just annoys me, because there, there's nothing wrong with... Okay, maybe the Scout Bike Squad should have gone years ago. I'm pretty sure I am younger than this kit. But getting rid of Land Speeders doesn't make sense. Getting rid of the Assault Squad doesn't make sense. Getting rid of the Company Command... Really doesn't make sense. Getting rid of the Tech Marine doesn't make sense. Getting rid of the Scouts. Maybe update the Scouts because this, they are, <laughs> his little face. <laughs> oh dear. It's, it's his little face, <laughs> look. Yeah, they need an update. Maybe they'll get updated, but I've got a horrible feeling it's going to be Primarist. And if you're a fan of Firstborn, which lots of people are, them getting rid of Assault Squads must hurt. Because Assault... There was nothing wrong with the Assault Squads. Oh, but they're older, and they still hold up. Hell, they are probably one of the best Warhammer kits for Space Marines. Seriously, the Assault Squad is really fucking good. If you wanted to kitbash some really cool characters... Use the Assault Squad box. You could easily kitbash a really cool looking Primaris Lieutenant out of that box. But, yeah, they've gotten rid of that. And I've got, the, I've got a horrible feeling they're either going to update the Vanguard Veterans. So, you know, it, it's technically not Primaris. But, they're, but it's going to be Primaris size, so true scale. Or you're going to get Primaris Assault Marines. Which will be a kick in the teeth for for non-Primaris fans. And I understand that Primaris are popular, but just because something's popular doesn't mean it's good. Look at this channel, for example. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not an expert on videos like these. Um, honestly, if you want someone to do a proper, in-depth discussion about this, go watch Kirioff. He's much better at this than I am. Uh, I, I'm, I prefer to script my memes uh, than... Then, you know, ramble about stuff that I barely understand. But I do understand that getting rid of kits like this is a shame. And it marks an end of an era. Because Space Marines have been bloated. And because there's a massive update coming round the corner because of the new Space Marine Codex. I bet you anything that with these new updates that we're going to see... It's going to be Primaris, obviously, but it's also going to lack weapon options. It's going to it's going to be streamlined because Tenth Edition is incredibly streamlined. And what really annoys me about this is the fact that this wasn't mentioned a couple of months ago, when when everything else was last chance to buy. Like they they did a massive oh this is last chance to buy thing for Forge World. This would have been a good time to also throw this in. Because people have gone out and brought land speeders. Thinking, oh, they wouldn't get rid of land speeders. And they have. But don't worry, you can use it in Legends. Whoopty fucking do. It's, it's just a damn shame. It really is. And I bet you we're going to see land speeders. But Primaris... We're going to see bike squads, but Primaris, because, you know, Primaris is popular. Doesn't mean it's any good. And it does mark an end of an era, and it just makes me sad. Because it's... Because because Primaris are monopos, and you don't get a lot of weapon options, it, it, just, it just annoys me. Because the joy that I have with this hobby is kit bashing. It's one of the reasons why I like... Hey, he's going to mention it again. But it's one of the reasons why I like Necromunder a lot. Because you can kitbash easy. Like, 
well, easily. Uh, you can kit bash easy, great. Uh, no, you can kit bash easily because there's weapon options there. That it's, 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 you know, you. It's reasonably safe to assume that nothing will get out of date. Unlike this, where it's like, oh, I've just brought such and such unit. Oh, I can't use that now. It's it just it just smacks of bad communication. It really does, and I'm gonna go <laughs> because I don't know what else to say. It's bad communication. This video's far too long, and yeah, it just sucks if you're a firstborn fan. Oh, but don't worry though, you still have tactical marines, and you still have devastator squads, and you took away assault squads. That's not going to cut it. A lot of people, the reason lots of people still like Firstborn is because Firstborn has that freedom to kitbash. You have a lot of weapon options. You can make a lot of different models using the same box. It's fun to kitbash. And also the lore for the Firstborn is a lot more coherent than the law for the Primaris. I, I honestly don't understand it. Uh, yeah, I, I need to get up to date on my 40k law. However, my Necromunda law knowledge, mm, perfect, near enough. Uh, it, it's just a shame. It really is. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go. And I'm going to talk about something positive, because I need to. So, I'll see you later. Take care, stay safe, and look after each other. Bye for now.